Minecraft builders who dedicated years of their lives to building the Great Pyramids of the Taj Mahal in Disney World, only to be outdone by AI in a matter of days. How you doing everybody? It's me Waddles. Today we're going to talk a little bit about Mojang's brand new AI that can allegedly do literally everything in Minecraft. Drop those thingy caps on lads because the implications for this one, they're pretty big. We're going to talk all about that and what it could mean for the future. Minecraft 2? But you know, out of the blue, without any context at all, this could all seem pretty shocking and somewhat random. I think we... I think we need to go back. It's hard to believe, sure, but a mere 2,023 years ago, the universe looked something like this, allegedly. A bunch of dust and some pixels. I do believe these pixels represent the very first planets and stars. Now in between then and 2014, a lot happens. It's actually pretty crazy. It all culminated when popular musician, singer, songwriter, and all-around icon Taylor Swift dropped the hit single Shake It Off. The song Shake It Off off of the album 1989 actually refers to a common phrase players would say when they get poisoned by a cave spider down in the mine shafts in that era. And with that, the perfect segue that we needed. We went from the beginning of the universe to Minecraft in just two steps. It's not bad. And now that we're all good and caught up, AI. It definitely feels like recently AI is like the big hype the new trend, the next big thing. It definitely feels like recently things have been taking off when it comes to AI, like it's been getting advanced. It feels like out of the blue, within like the past two months or something, you went from AI that couldn't even open a door to AI that can all of a sudden impersonate every person's voice on TikTok for these like insane Minecraft parodies. <laughs> and I can't stop watching them. Stuff is pretty crazy actually, but allegedly Microsoft is getting in on it too. So everything we're talking about today is all thanks to this article right here. It's got the scoop of Microsoft and Mojang's secret new Minecraft AI. With all these crazy advancements happening, it really was only a matter of time until Microsoft, the big puppy that owns Minecraft, and also one of the richest corporations in the world, would get involved. Lads, it looks like that moment is here. According to the scoop, Microsoft is working on an AI that can do things in Minecraft. And anything, too. If they can pull this off, which it looks like they might be able to, this is pretty insane. Imagining me as your standard, typical, beautiful AI. I just created a brand new world. As an AI that knows nothing about Minecraft, my first hurdle would be figuring out how to move. So, <laughs> you know, something like this. After that, I have to figure out how to jump. If auto jump is off, I, I could try to move in this block forever, and I wouldn't even be able to do anything. Eventually, I would figure out how to jump. Then I need to figure out what a tree in the game is. If I don't know what a tree is, and I'm mining this for hours trying to get wood, it's not going to work. Eventually, if I could figure out what a tree is, then I would have to learn the recipes. Crafting recipes are one of those things we take for granted nowadays because after all, every single new survival game that drops and the survival games that were meant to drop literally years ago actually use these things. Crafting recipes are where things get advanced. Not only do you need to figure out the shape of the recipes, but you also need to figure out the materials that you need to be using too. And as an AI that is like, I don't know, blind or something, how's it going to be able to figure all this stuff out? Microsoft has shown off an internal demo that gives users the ability to control its popular Minecraft video game by telling the game what to do, instead of doing it manually. Now this is an internal demo, which means unfortunately we can't see it, but knowing Microsoft, this thing, I mean it's gotta be insane, right? Taking into account all of that advanced stuff that we were just talking about a second ago, if Mojang or Microsoft can even figure out how to get a player to start to move and climb up a hill, I, I mean, that's already a solid W. It's, it's pretty advanced. Like, not that you need another example, but imagine that hill right over there. I, if an AI tried to climb that hill, they wouldn't be able to necessarily figure it out. And if they can do that, well, I guess they could do anything. When I first heard about this top secret AI project last week, I was intrigued. That led me to do a little bit more digging. In the replies of this tweet thread that I randomly, like so luckily stumbled across, I found another interesting project. This is something called Project Malmo. Complete side note, why does every single one of these AI projects sound like it's something that is going to literally cause the end of the world? <laughs> is this not a red flag? Project Malmo. Speaking of climbing up hills, Project Malmo does exactly that. Project Malmo is a sophisticated AI experimentation platform based on Minecraft mods to climb hills. Okay, probably not actually only to climb hills, but that was the first big thing that they were working on. After doing a little bit of digging for you, I found that Project Malmo's first goal was to do exactly what we were talking about a second ago, 
get a player into a world and teach this player that is an AI how to walk around and eventually climb a hill. Climbing a hill is another one of those things we take for granted nowadays because every game that has hills actually has hills, but it's kind of advanced. It involves some pathfinding. This whole AI experimentation thing with figuring out how to climb up hills is from 2016. It's a long time ago. I wasn't able to find the results of this whole Project Malmo thing. It seems the US government swooped in and covered it up or something. But if they could figure it out back then, imagine what they could do now. Now you have to excuse my ignorance for this time, I'm only a YouTuber, but speaking of AI and all this stuff like this, this makes me think of the villager. Is the villager in, in a way, like, in, in a sense, not an AI? Admittedly, maybe the AI needs a little bit of work, but essentially, this villager would need to find a way to pathfind up that hill, apparently it's taken a long way, but pathfind up the hill to get to its workstation right there. It's, it's kind of like literally an AI. Ah, uh, they need some work. Look, listen, I'm no theorist, but when it comes to the AI and pathfinding, it seems like Mojang actually already has that down, and it's in the game. Once this AI nails walking around, locks in crafting recipes, then it's able to do literally anything else, including build structures, and maybe eventually, actually learn how to build good structures. This AI demo was made possible by Cutting Edge AI. Applying commands to Minecraft is challenging because the game has a lot of different variables. Until recently, attempts to train computer models to automatically navigate and build in Minecraft have had limited results. But last year, OpenAI said it trained a computer model to play Minecraft by having it watch 70,000 hours of videos of people playing the game. Hey, <laughs> maybe I'm in there. Long story short, it's all some pretty advanced and actually kind of crazy stuff. And even more intriguingly, it seems like they're making progress on this. Thinking about it from a thinking standpoint, Microsoft probably wouldn't start telling people about this thing if they have no progress made at all. And if they were able to experiment with AI and presumably figure it out back in 2016, at least when it comes to movement, what they could probably pull off now has got to be pretty insane. Minecraft is quite literally a world of infinite possibilities. If limited to survival mode, of course, you could accomplish a pretty impressive grind if the AI gets smart enough. But when opened up to creative mode, literally anything's possible. With the help of commands, Mojang's AI would gain even more superpowers, from being able to change biomes, to being able to place a lot of blocks quickly, to being able to delete literally everything. Like everything. The possibilities are infinite. I mean, for example, if this AI could change a biome, maybe with a tiny bit of input, this AI would be able to come up with a new biome and perfect it, and also fit it in somewhere inside of the world. Another fun potential implication of this AI stuff here comes in the form of structures. Of course, I know we're talking about some relatively advanced stuff here, but theoretically, let's say this AI is eventually trained to know Minecraft inside and out. Every single survival fact, it's got it. Every single trick, it knows it. Heck, every single clutch, it also has it down perfectly. It could build, you know, everything like that. If eventually that were to be the case, the devs could theoretically use the AI to design structures, right? Like, come up with a really cool structure that maybe comes in a couple different variants, like a maze or something, I don't know. And... Yeah, they use the AI. <laughs> or how about terrain, world generation? Look, I'll be honest, despite what you might think, I'm not a game developer. I know next to nothing about it and the process that goes into it. I don't know what it was like for the devs behind the scene to develop the 1.18 plus generation, but it definitely seems like it could have been tricky stuff. I don't know if it would have been possible for the devs to use some kind of advanced AI to maybe like help shape caves, figure out cave water levels, shape of mountains and terrain in general. I don't know. It just sounds like it could work, right? If Mojang, with the cash funds of Microsoft backing them up, is able to create an AI that can do like anything in Minecraft, this AI could literally make Minecraft. With the addition of archeology, span the sniffer, and the brand new cherry grove biome, last week was a pretty shocking week. But in the grand scheme of things, all of those additions are pretty predictable actually. A brand new wood set? Yeah, it checks out for Minecraft. Another mob? Mm-hmm, that makes sense too. Archaeology, something that they said was going to come to the game? Yeah, that checks out. My whole point here with this part is to add something to Minecraft, first you would have to understand the whole vibe of Minecraft. You, a developer, or say an AI, would have to know that more wood types is something that Minecraft definitely would have. Meanwhile, like... Like a literal car. Y yeah, that wouldn't really make sense in Minecraft. Of course, this is all theoretical, but even the craziest of additions, you know, strange things like the Strider, entire fantasy, they make sense for Minecraft. 
If an AI were to learn the game inside and out, get super smart, very advanced, then theoretically, this AI could essentially suggest or maybe even design all of the features for the next update or even the sequel to Minecraft. Look, long story short, this is all super interesting. Behind the scenes, Microsoft and Mojang are working on an AI that can do literally everything in Minecraft. It probably will never release to the public, but who knows what they'll be able to do with it behind the scenes. Look, of course, like we just talked about, there are so many implications for this AI. If you can figure out a Minecraft, it could literally make Minecraft. But another one could maybe be bug fixing. Imagine if Mojang were able to develop an AI that is so smart that understands everything about Minecraft, including the code, and that it could just plug that AI into a potential future update and, and patch out all the bugs. Now, I don't know if we're to that point quite yet, but I don't know. It's an interesting thought. To conclude this video, I started thinking about AI and if I could maybe just mod one into the game myself and by myself, I, could I just like literally install an AI from CurseForge and <laughs> there we go. CurseForge is a big website and people call their mods whatever they want to call their mods. So I can't be sure if there's like literally no AI mod on all of CurseForge, but I wasn't able to find one, unfortunately. Anyways, that's Mojang and Microsoft's secret AI project that has a goal of being able to do anything and everything Minecraft from survive to thrive to maybe even make Minecraft too. Who knows? Any takes, thoughts on this thing? Throw them down in the comments below. Maybe I've completely misunderstood AI. <laughs> Call me out. I hope you enjoyed the video. I know it was a little bit different than usual. If you made it to this point in the video, you're like literally the best person in the world. Dude, thank you. Like for more videos like this, subscribe too. This is Mimi Waddles, and I'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye, everyone.